Good morning, dear children. So today we are going to start English lesson number two, the floating duck. Okay, let's start. Dorothy is very fond of toys. So here, Dorothy is a name of a girl. Okay, and fond means she loves. Okay, so Dorothy is a girl and she loves toys. Okay. One day she got a toy duck. So can you tell me what did she get one day? Yes, correct. She got a toy duck. Okay. The toy duck was, uh, sorry, the toy duck was able to float on water. It was able to talk also. It was in fact a computer duck. Okay. So what uh, that toy duck was able to do? Can you tell me? Yes. Correct. The toy duck was able to talk. Was able to float on the water also. So why? As you know toys cannot talk. But this toy duck was able to talk. And was able to float also on the water because it was a computer duck. Okay, because this duck was a computer duck, that's why it was able to float on water and was able to talk also. Okay, then Dorothy became very happy. She was Thinking about the floating duck all the time. Now, Dorothy was very happy because now she had a toy duck. And she was also thinking about the floating duck all the time. Okay, because she got this new toy duck. That should, that's why she was thinking about this toy duck all the time. Okay. At night, she dreamt going to a riverside with her toy duck. The river was quite close to the sea. So kids, quite close means very near. Okay. So at night, she, she saw uh, in her dream that she is going to a riverside. You can see in the picture also. Okay. Is the riverside? It's a river. So she is going to the riverside with the toy duck, and that river is very close to a sea. Okay, so this is the river, and here is the toy duck, and here is the Dorothy and other kids. Okay, so all these things are happening in her dream only. Okay, in her dream. As she put the duck into water, it started floating. <coughs> there was a crowd of children. They all congratulated Dorothy for having such a fine duck. Okay. So, what happened next? In her dream only, okay, she saw that her toy duck is floating on the water. As you can see in the picture also. Okay, and all the other children, okay, are congratulating her as she has such a nice toy duck. Okay, so that's why all the children were congratulating Dorothy as she has a such a nice toy duck. You can see in the picture, all were seeing, all are seeing the toy duck and all are appreciating also. Okay, now what happened next? The little duck was very happy. It began to float on water in the river. The river was deep and large. The waves of river water tossed the duck up and down. The duck was thrilled. It went away and away. When it went very far, it got a little frightened. Now here, tossed means move up and down. Okay. Because of the waves, the duck was moving 
up and down. Crossed means up and moving up and down. Thrilled means very excited. Frightened means afraid. Okay. So, where were we here? So, the toy dog was very excited and it was very happy also. Why? Because it was floating in the water. You can see in the picture also. Okay. It was floating in the water in the river. And the river was very deep and large. This river was very deep and large. And because of the waves, it was going up and down. And because this river is very big and uh, there are so many waves, so this uh, duck was floating up and down in the river water. Okay. Then next, uh, swoosh. There was a big noise. The little duck looked up. A very big seagull was coming down towards it. The duck gave a frightened quack. Now kids, what is the meaning of quack? Quack means the sound that a duck makes. Quack, quack. Okay, like that. So, and what is the meaning of seagull? So, seagull is a bird that lives near the sea. You can see in the picture also. This is a picture of a seagull. Okay. So, suddenly what happened? The duck heard a big noise. Which type of noise? Swoosh. Okay. And it saw a very big seagull coming towards it. Okay. So, kids, what did the duck, uh, toy duck see coming towards it? Huh? Yes, correct. Toy duck saw a very big seagull coming towards it. Okay. The toy duck started quacking because of the fear. Okay. And the toy duck became frightened and started quacking. Now, at last, the seagull pounced upon the little duck. It picked the duck in its long beak and went up high. Here, pounced means attacked. Okay. So, at last what happened? The seagull attacked upon the little duck. Okay. And it picked and went up high in the sky. Okay. So, in this um, video, we will, uh, we have uh, read uh, till here. And in next video class, we will continue the lesson. Thank you kids.